over the last 40 years, uh, we have put up the 401k as a way to save money so you have this big pile of cash and then at retirement, it's supposed to pay you out until you pass away. But really, should we be focused on creating streams of income that pay us every single month. Now, I don't have like the perfect scenario, but I do know that the average 401k uh, account in 2023 is only $50,000. So realistically, before we even get started, let's think about you. How do you envision retiring? You know, like what all are the things that you want to do? Like, where do you want to live? Do you want to travel often? How do you want your retirement to look? Because really, this is not necessarily about me and, and, and how I'm planning my retirement, but it, it should be more about you and how you can take some of the things that I do, if you like them, and implement them so you can create that particular lifestyle for yourself. Because let's be honest, re a retirement is about lifestyle, okay? Retirement is about how you want to live, um, the places that you want to travel, the time that you have this, to spend with your family. It is completely about lifestyle. Um, but the way I see retirement is not with an age. I, I like what they did with the 401k and, and they put an age on it, 65. But realistically, why would I want to retire at 65? Think about retirement, not as this big lump sum, but more about the monthly cash flow. How much do you need to do the things that you want to do every single month? And then how can we create some kind of system or method that gets me that particular income every single month so I can do the things that I want. And now we need this particular income, maybe take a little bit of my time, but not take a lot of my time. Because realistically, retirement is about enjoying your time. It's about lifestyle. Let me tell you the different ways that I make money real quick. My main source of income is in real estate as a whole, is in real estate investing. I am not an agent. Everybody stop asking me that. A real estate investor uses real estate, real property, in order to make profits in ownership. Now, some of those deals I wholesale, some of those deals I hold as rentals and get paid monthly on, some of those are Airbnb, short-term rentals, or group homes. Some of the houses that I buy, I buy as is and I sell as is. I do, I do flips on them or rehab them and do flips as well to make money. But I also have other streams of income like my affiliate income, where I'm helping to promote other companies that have been good to me, like Deal Machine, you know, which is my, which is a deal finding software that I use, you know, or like Carrot, the website host that I use that have, you know, that has made me money as well. Uh, the next source of income uh, is inside of my digital products, inside of my education company. So we have a few courses uh, where we teach guys how to find deals and, and we teach people how to, you know, invest in real estate themselves because I've been able to do it. So, hey, I, I figure I can teach somebody else to do it. And now over the last seven years, I've really had a good chance to work all of these different incomes pretty much simultaneously at the same time. And I figured out which ones don't require a lot of my time because that's what retirement it is. It's, it's being able to make money without having to take a lot of time to make it. And realistically, out of those streams of income, I'm going to share with you the income streams that don't take almost any of my time. I'm talking four hours a week or less of my time so I can make money and then you guys can, you know, copy and paste it in your lifestyle as well. Number one is the rental properties, long term, long term rental property. OK, long term, meaning I, uh, I purchased a property. Uh, whether that's a condo, single family home, whatever, okay, apartment complex, purchase a single family home and I rent that property out, okay, I don't include any of the utilities or anything like that to someone that's on Section 8 or private pay and they stay there for a year, two years, five years or longer. That, that money is so consistent, is, is crazy, okay, and realistically, that money will always come in because people need a place you know, to stay. People need a place to live. And the coolest part is no matter what, okay, no matter what, if you hold a property long enough, it will always 
pay for itself and give you this net, net, net profit. Now, are some years better than other years? Absolutely, because sometimes you will have a roof or you will have an HVAC or something like that, something big that needs to go on. But realistically, over a three to five year period, these things pay you every single month without any complication. Now, my second favorite way of making passive income so we can have for retirement is Airbnbs or I hate, to, I hate to use Airbnb as a noun because realistically, they're just one marketing tool for our short-term rentals. Yesterday alone, one house, paid, matter of fact, it's not even a house, it's an apartment. A one bedroom, one bath studio has no doors, paid me 200, excuse me, $2,290 for one day when you as you start to hear these different kind of income streams and and how they're you know uh the, we're talking about the more passive ones today you'll start to understand that you can set these incomes not to just come in once a month like your 401k would um, or not once a month like social security would but they can come in every day multiple times a day i i really like the short-term rentals because they they're just long-term rentals on steroids that's my second favorite way that i make monthly income I mean, it just comes in and I really don't have to do anything for it. Now, the third income that I really, 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 really like, and that's my real estate education company. Um, uh, people, people, we always talk about this because I get so much more fulfillment out of teaching you how to do the business you know, how to get your first deal, how to get your first rental, how to create passive income for yourself. But I don't make the majority of my money from teaching, but I do get passive money from it. So we have a, a group weekly coaching call and it's like a, a monthly, uh, it's like a monthly program that our students join and I get paid monthly from that. And we do these calls every Sunday now. So that does take a little bit of my time. Okay. Like I said, we're talking about four hours or less. So every Sunday, it does take me about an hour and a half to do those calls um, every week. We got about 30 students that see value in that and that I teach every single week in that. And I'm grateful for that. Okay. Super passive way to make uh, to make income. And I honestly don't see there being any end to that. I'm doing the business. So literally on Sundays, I just share what I did in my business to get the result with you. Now, this last one is the affiliate money. Okay. It's, a, it's getting paid to promote somebody else's product. But this, this is the easiest money that I make every single month. I literally send out emails. Once again, it takes a little time. Send out emails once a week for each of my, uh, um, for at least one of my, uh, one of my affiliate partners. And, and I get paid, you know, a thousand to $2,500 a month for simply sharing uh, those particular, those particular companies in that month. I mean, uh, an email, a post on Instagram, a post on YouTube and a post on threads you know, or bring in a thousand to twenty five hundred dollars a month just by sharing those companies. And literally, like I said, four hours or less a week. That's what retirement is about. OK, that's what retirement is about. It doesn't take me much, if not any, for my rental properties, if not much, if m not much, if not any for my short term rentals, OK, for my affiliate money, you know, or, you know, taking the time with you guys on Sundays and teaching how you guys can get started in real estate. So if you guys believe that the 401k that you have is not growing fast enough to pay for the funds that you need to do the traveling that you want, to have the house that you want, to pay for your kid college like you want to, to pay for your daughter's wedding like you want to, I encourage you, learn something. It doesn't have to be real estate, but learn something that can help you earn money passively why you're hanging out with the kids, why you're washing the car. It is the greatest feeling waking up, looking at your phone, and instead of going to Instagram first, you see a PayPal alert. And it's like, oh, great. <laughs> Welcome to Monday, <laughs> all right? So look, if you guys wanna learn how to invest in real estate, go ahead and click the like button, go ahead and subscribe, because we give away the game here on how you guys can use real estate investing without any money, learning how to leverage other people's mortgages so that way you can get the benefits of appreciation, depreciation, and monthly cash flow so you can live the life that you want. Peace, y'all. I'll see you on the next one.